Hello, everyone. It's Big Dog. Uh, I went to an auction last night, and I got some good stuff, some decent things. Not everything is great, but I go to the flea market, too, and sell, so I take other stuff to the flea market. So let's get into what I got. So the first thing I saw that I liked was this. Now, it's not perfect by far. One of the part of this the ski down here is broke. It is missing the propellers and the piece of tail. But this is 12 inch GI Joe helicopter. It, it does kind of work. It needs a little cleaning in there. But so I picked that up. That was a two dollar purchase. So I thought that was pretty cool. Now, things I wanted at the auction were scattered. That, like I said, that was outside. It's the only thing I bought outside. And then some other things throughout. So, one of the next things I bought was this wrestling lot. Now, when it comes to wrestling, the accessories is what people want. So, the tables, ladder, crutches, barbells. Hi. Uh, there's a belt in there. There's Hornswoggle's hat, which I have a Hornswoggle, so now I got his hat. Uh, so I got that. Came with these DVDs, John Cena, Chris Jericho, WrestleMania. Uh, and a couple books, John Cena again. Randy Orton, CM Punk, The Rock, John Cena, Undertaker, Triple H, Who Will Stop, John Cena, and The Undertaker. When I bought this, uh, the auctioneer put these up. I didn't want them. But uh, when I bought that, just before the, he slammed the hammer, he threw these in with it. He knows I'm a toy guy, so nobody else wanted them when they tried to auction it off. So I wound up getting them anyway, basically a freebie. But uh, And the Darth Vader and these batteries. The ones that are in are dead. So. There were several things that I seen that I wanted. But I didn't want to actually buy it all. Because there was a box of this stuff. This Lord of the Rings collector box set. Eight double sided 8 by 10 posters. And. Was bugging out motion sensor maybe I don't know crazy but uh series one two and what's that six these are the pictures so a guy went up buying all these and I think there was like maybe twelve we have a dozen or more maybe. So I said, hey, will you sell me one? He said, yeah. So I bought one. So that was kind of cool. Now I went ahead and in the back of the table, in the very back, one of the last tables, I seen all this stuff over here and this, my little pony set. And... I didn't see it at first. I got told about it and I had to go find it. But it was right next to this G.I. Joe stuff and I didn't even realize it. But anyhow, My Little Pony. Lately, I've been coming across a lot of My Little Pony stuff. Uh, My Little Pony does sell pretty good. So this is a really nice carrying case. Very, very good shape. No rips, tears, no mildew, no nothing. Really, really good shape.
1983. But anyhow, inside, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven My Little Ponies. And they're all decent. I mean, I don't know my name. This has a brush. If anybody knows their names, let me know. I'm just starting to really start getting a lot of My Little Pony stuff. My wife always says, Honey, you never put girl stuff. So I've been buying girl stuff. So... A lot of unicorns. I think everyone's a unicorn except that one. This one isn't either. They're really good shape. I mean, they got a little bit of, like, kind of little scuffs on them, but I'm sure you can get that off with a magic racer. But, I mean... Got the jewelry. Really, really good shape. So that was a good score. I actually paid up on this. Now the auction lets you if you see something you want, you can pull it and then they'll sell it separate. But what happened is I pulled this and the kid put it with some other stuff that some other guy wanted. So we got in a bidding war. And then after I got it. I went to him, I said, what did you want? He said, I wanted the other stuff. So he paid me. We worked it out. So my bill went half of what it was. So I think I went for 30 bucks, and then he wound up giving me $15 for the two things he wanted. So $15 score right there, and I know I can get way more than that out of it. So like I said, next to that was all this GI Joe stuff. So this whole box had all this in it so here's a woody now someone took his voice box out i don't know if they went to put batteries in it and they never put the batteries in they never put it back in him and he does have a broken spur on this boot but other than that he is like super super clean this is one of the original ones so really really good comes with his hat With that also, I got a new phone, everybody. Look, I've been saying I need a new phone. I bought one, but I'm not even using it for videos right now. Don't make any sense, right? 5G, 100-some gigabyte. So, <laughs> probably way better what I'm using, but I'm still trying to figure it out. So, I got this Pluto. I have him twice missing the tail. This one has his tail. That was in the box. This little doom buggy, which is, I don't know, know who it's made by. I don't even know. And this bubbly um, trailer, not the tractor ain't in there, but the trailer there. But I think I have a white tractor. I'll just put this on the white tractor. I'm trying to be complete as I can. Some of these little people were here, ran there, the dog. So that was in the box. I could sell that off as a lot. There's a dog in there. They're jamming now, right? All right. Roof, roof. All right, turn off. Oh. Oh, my God. One more time. I swear I won't touch it after that. All right, shut up. Yeah. It's quiet. So, anyhow, uh, also in there was this Thor cape. And I have a Thor, I can actually put this on, so that's all right. 
Uh, this Ninja Turtle stuff was in there. This is more modern Ninja Turtle stuff. But I guess you can take pieces off, piece them together. Uh, I do have the... Uh, I do have the guy, Metal Face. But uh, I think mine's missing an arm, but there is an arm in here. I just hope it's the right one. This here is in there. Superpowers. Or is it the other one? I get them mixed up. Secret Wars. I think this one might be Secret Wars. Or Superpowers. I can't remember. It's one of them. One of them. I have a Green Lantern. Uh, mine is missing an arm. This one is complete and he's in very, very good clean condition. So, very cool. This was in there. I don't know what this is. I don't know if it's a weapon or something for something. The Ninja Turtles are in there. Or not Ninja Turtles. California Raisins are in there. Now, these sell pretty good. I'm actually pretty low on them, so I needed these. Uh oh, he didn't want to stay. California raisins. Uh, this was in there. Now this here, Dell laptop, international power adapter. When you go overseas, they have a different kind of current. I think they're uh, we're one ten over here. I think they're one twenty or something over there, and uh. Some are higher than that, 250 volts. So this is like the adapter you would plug in their wall. They have these weird looking plugs depending on where you go that are all different, different styles. And uh, depending on what plug they have over there, like this is the regular style for us. But uh, then you would plug this, the plug, into the back of this, well, this would plug into your computer, and the other side is the female in. Somewhere over there. So you'd plug this into this, and then whatever plug you need for wherever you're at, whether it's Italy or Spain or wherever. Sorry, sorry. Hand got a little sweaty. So that was in the bag as well. The last thing I heard in the box, I mean, and the last thing that was in the box is just G.I. Joe stuff. Now, this here is missing one missile, and it's missing a, a gun that goes on the side. But, uh, so that's there. Got this G.I. Joe character. Got this kind of cycle. But that's missing one half of his wheels in the back. Slides in there so it looks like it has two sets of them. Then you have this trailer, which is complete. This one's missing the sides, but I think I have sides somewhere. Which, probably this week I'm going to do my G.I. Joe stuff. This is apart from a G.I. Joe. I don't know where it goes to. Got it figured out. I love my Google Lens. I uh, got this piece. So that's kind of neat. Like this. Yeah, that looks complete. Other than, I gotta figure out what goes here. But uh, I got this little kind of ripper thing. Now, I have one of these, but it's black with gold, so I don't know what this is covered, so I don't know what it is. I have a couple of these. Got that gel holder for putting a couple of figures in there, or accessories, or whatever you have. So, uh, then there was this Tiger little hovercraft boat. Missing a lot of pieces, 
but I, like I said, I have 14 boxes of GI Joe stuff. So when I go through it, I'm going to try to piece together what I can. Here's a vamp, tagger vamp. Now this piece up here is broke right down there on the bin. So it's holding on barely. So that was in the box, like I said, that was in the back of the auction. It's one of the last things. And uh, there's a couple of people up there that buy a lot of stuff. And when they buy stuff, they what they'll do is they'll turn around and say, hey, I got what I wanted off that table. I bought the whole table. If there's something you want, take it. So I have two people to do that for me. And then I go through and just pick some things. So I'm just Philly Fanatic. He's in good shape, a little smelly. Let's see if I can get him cleaned up. So he's all right. Got this Kodak Easy Share. Like I said, I go to the flea market, I sell other things. So I'll take this to the flea market unless I decide to keep it. I love, I would love, I was in the service for a long time, 13 years. And I would love, I have so many pictures. I would love to scan and be able to put on something like this. Put in my Navy room when I start working on it. And then uh, this was there, which is like a little nook. Which I don't know nothing about these. So kind of cool. Like I said, free reign. Go get what you want. And I got this. I have a box of... Uh, non-movable figures like this i mean the arms move and the legs move that's it and i uh, i just put them all in a box this box of uh quarter that thing ray split window kind of cool uh this whole box of of uh hot wheels and that's after there there's not really nothing much in here Lindsay Matchbox Trash Truck, which I could have sold yesterday. If I was at the store on, on Wednesday. He buys trash trucks for his son because he works on trash truck. So, so that was that. Now this is free stuff I'm going through now. So, um, this here's kind of neat. It's a game set. Okay, chess, checkers. You got the pyramid game, dominoes. Uh, I don't know what that is. There's cards in here, there's cribbage in here. And then you got these. And then underneath this, there's all the game boards and stuff to tell you exactly what's what but I don't know I'm not going to go through it all but so that was good this was also in that lot now these are brand new they're still sealed boxes are a little beat but this is Five Nights at Freddy's diorama sets Paper Pals Party Withered Bonnie the sister location, Enard, the scooping room, this is a happy birthday, two figures are inside, so, and here's another sister's location. Control module. Fun time foxy. So that was in my free stuff. This was in my free stuff. Bernstein Bears in the dark. Star Wars head to head. 30 watts matchups you've never seen. Jawas vs. Ewoks. It's kind of cool. I'm going to sit down and read this, I think. Best of Spider-Man. America's Favorite Comic Strip Hero. 
his orange, his S plates. I got that wrong. His triumphs, disasters, told by the creator Stan Lee. Now this book is not bad shape. Now there is a section in the back that has come off back here, but you can see it right there how it's not right, but maybe I can see if I can get it fixed. I don't know. We'll see. Now these are uh, America Story, book one and book two. So I thought they were neat. I have another gentleman. He, uh, he likes to help the communities and stuff. So he buys a lot of uh, shoes, baseball stuff, stuff like that for the kids. And he buys these for senior citizens, puzzles and stuff. So there's a box of puzzles. And he asked if I was going to go on it. I said, I just want this puzzle. I have a fire truck gentleman. He, uh, so I saw this 700 piece fire truck set. So that was like really cool. So it's still factory sealed. Box is a little beat, but they're puzzle pieces. I'm sure they're fine. And then uh, this turns out to be 36 by 36 by 15 and a half. So it's a pretty decent size. So that was given to me. And then uh, a buddy of mine bought these. And then after he bought them, he offered them to me. So I took them, bought them off him. So, there's PS2. In the PS2, Tiger Woods. That was a baller, by the way. I'm sorry. Uh, Tiger Woods. Bratz. Diamond Z. Uh, super Truck Racing. Uh, American Chopper 2. Lord of the Rings. These are all PS2 games. Uh, 2K5. Family Game Night. Enter the Matrix. And Boogie. Also, there was uh, PS3 games in this lot. There's Battlefield. Bad Company 2. NHL 10. MLB The Show. Madden 10, NHL 09, Tiger Woods 08, and another PS2 game, 13. So, that's my auction pickups from last night. So, like I said, hey, did all this stuff here, well, not those, not the games, but all this box stuff, all the way up to the Philly Fanatic was free. I had bought that. This was basically a throw-in. That was a $2 pickup. And then my G.I. Joe lot over here. So, not bad pickups last night. So, this is Big Dog. Rate, subscribe, hit that like button. Tell your friends. My numbers are going up slowly, but they're still going up. Appreciate that, everybody that's joined in. Uh, and until the next one, this is Big Dog. Everybody be safe. Big Dog's out.